All right. My name is Josh Herrick. Uh, I truly feel like it is a blessing to have this opportunity to be baptized at Oak Bridge. My story is maybe unique in the fact that I was baptized as a baby and have had a walk with the Lord ever since I was a young kid. Over this past year, though, I've had a calling to have a true believer baptism. Honestly, this past year, I've probably been the least comfortable than I've ever been in, before in my life. From dealing with anxiety, to living on my own, to graduating and moving out into the real world. The thing I realize, though, is sometimes God gives us the gift of desperation and change to make us stronger and lean on Him more and more. Through some of these obstacles and challenges, it really made me open my heart and trust in the Lord. This past fall, I was sick and at home down in the small town of Bolivar, Missouri. I was toward the stretch run of my student teaching before I would graduate from Southwest Baptist University in December. The interesting thing is that this was the only day I missed the entire fall teaching. And as God works many times, I truly believe things happen for a reason. So my neighbor, who I had never met at the time, was chopping wood outside his house. And I saw him and introduced myself and said hi. Come to find out that he was actually a biblical translator and was a believer himself. So we decided to have a couple Bible studies together over the next couple weeks. On the first night of the Bible study, he asked me a very poignant question. When you were baptized as a baby, was it your choice and was it an expression of your own faith? And I humbly, I had to honestly answer no. And he asked me, would I like to be baptized? And I said, absolutely. So I really do believe in the saying, everything happens for a reason. It kind of got me thinking about the verse in Romans 8.28. And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God and to them who are called according to his purpose. Through some of these different times and difficult times, I knew that God had a purpose for my life. Also, I feel really thankful for this baptism because it's truly an expression of my faith. I believe that Jesus Christ is Lord and rose from the grave. Christ has been with me through everything in my life. And from this point forward, I want to surrender my life to him. Thank you. Um, he's my nephew, so I've had a chance to um, see him as a little guy swinging a baseball bat. And uh, a little guy, he's kind of big. Um, so he, he talked a little bit about his story. I think it was amazing. I think he was going through some of the challenges of life. Uh, we talked a little bit. And I said, God's going to use that, that story for his glory one day. And uh, what's amazing is he's a teacher now and he's a coach. Um, and God sometimes uses that story in all of our lives, put in situations where we can share that. Um, situation. Um, God's doing amazing things in your life, Josh. I see your passion for Christ. Um, I know you're going to do amazing things um, with your story and with your life to each other. You already have. Uh, you reach out to me and say, hey, I want to be baptized. I'm like, let's get it on. Let's do it. Yeah. I love this. Yeah. It's the best day of the year for me. So I'm so proud of you, man. I'm so proud of the man nice. you are. Um, let's let's, let's get this ready. It's upon your uh, professional faith today, I'll baptize you as a father, son, and 